I don't think you'll be able to tell on video, but the right rear wheel on this Mazda MPV, whatever that Mazda van is, that thing is cambered out ridiculously. It even looks like it's towed out both rears. It looks way off. Oh yeah, the inside of the tires all chewed up. Oh, dick. Oh, bueno. We got Thursday night and a bit of a whirlwind of a day today. Just ordering parts all day. That's pretty much what I did. I had a, a client call at 11 o'clock and he approved uh, everything, which is great. But that means there's 66 services and about 240 some different parts I had to go and order and compare prices across 12 suppliers times 240. And it's just a lot. My eyes hurt from looking at a screen. You get tired of sitting, so you try to stand and work a little bit. Um, can't complain too much. It's great business. It's going to be a wonderful project on a 63,000, 65,000 mile 03 M5. Took in another one today. 01 M5, 49,000 miles. Doesn't quite look like it. I'll film it tomorrow. Came in with a John Deere battery in it. Wouldn't start. Uh, we put a real battery in it. Still wouldn't start. Checked the fuse and the relay for the fuel pump. Fuse was blown. Uh, relay seems to be okay. So battery and a fuse, that'll be quick and cheap to get him running. But the car needs a lot of other attention. So I'm going to talk to the owner tomorrow and see if, are we inspecting this? Are there other things he wants to do? Is he a DIYer? You know, everyone's different. So uh, we'll see what happens there and build a plan. And then tonight, 6.30 over at One Paseo, which I, now I kind of remember hearing about that. It's this relatively new, last five years maybe, shopping plaza, outdoor, really nice upscale shopping plaza, just east, southeast of Del Mar. And it was the monthly watch group. I cannot believe it's been a month since Ben was here and we went to that, that other brewery. That feels like two weeks. No, it's a freaking month already. So did that tonight. I, I'm kind of socialed out. We had a nice busy night last night and met Lars and Luke and then uh, more of that tonight. So it's nice to be home. A little bit of quiet. Lars is here. I picked her up some, uh, not smash burger, some, some Shake Shack. I had one of those over there. Ken and I had that for dinner there, but I brought her one back. So. Gonna go hang out inside a little bit, play with Peanut, get to bed here, tomorrow's Friday. Um, not driving the M5 this weekend, I gotta go to her place on um, Friday night, I just don't wanna leave that out, so. Get the 540 cleaned up tomorrow and it's overdue for that. And little sneak peek, we can't see anything in this lighting out here, and it's late, but I had an old customer steering wheel rewrapped as kind of a demo, I wanted to see how this company did. And it's pretty good, I I'd give it an A minus, I don't know that this is going to be the quality that people are looking for from us, but it's, it's a more affordable um, alternative compared to buying a new wheel, certainly, which you can't do for a 540. You can only buy the M5 wheels, and those are four figures. Um, the other option is Kobe Wheel, and their customer support did not really rub me the right way. They're expensive. They want to be out a couple of weeks, and they only offer Napa leather. The E39 platform cars never got Napa leather wheels, so... I don't think it's it fits the car. I understand making that an option, but give us the Dakota or Merino, whatever whatever the hell type of leather it was. Give us that as an option. So I'll shut up. We'll get a look. I wanted black stitching. This is not an M5. Everyone wants the um, tricolor stitching. I did not. So it's got black stitching. Um, this is a new piece of trim. I reused this from the customer wheel who didn't want to take his old stuff back, which is in better shape than mine, and the buttons feel nicer. So... New wheel on, certainly an improvement, nice and matte black, soft leather. Uh, I just wanted more grain, and I know that's weird, but that's what the interior of the 540 is. And with the 7 Series seats and the replaced, you know, new used rear seats, that's just, to me, what it should be. Anyways, I'm happy enough with it for now. And I'm going to bed. Talk Friday.